Now look at this one. This is the future of warfare. This is the LY-1 high power laser weapon system. It was displayed on an 8-wheeled HZ-141 vehicle, suggesting mobility and adaptability to both maritime and land environments. Actually, this was primarily designed for protecting ships against drones and missiles. But seeing it on a land-based vehicle, it appears to also have a role on land. It uses a high-energy laser beam to intercept drones, cruise missiles, helicopters and fixed-wing aircraft by disrupting or damaging the optical sensors of incoming threats. It's a game-changer for air defense. It is considered China's next-generation combat technology. As you can see right in front, there is a large circular beam emitter accompanied by smaller electro-optical and infrared apertures for precision targeting. And then the whole box is a sensor box consisting of radar or passive RF that strengthens its engagement capabilities. Now with a technology like this, it is fast, it hits with precision, plus the operating cost is very low because all it needs is onboard electrical energy. But then the challenging part is its high power demands, cooling systems and weather dependency. India is also in the race with DRDO successfully testing its own high power laser weapon systems. They are being tested. Once they are ready, they will be added to India's multi-domain defense capabilities.